So we were talking earlier off camera um, about budgetary challenges that everybody mm -hmm. seems to be stealing themselves for in, in mm -hmm. the military. There's going to be some cut of some magnitude coming down the line, and all sorts of military contractors are concerned about it. Um, in that kind of environment, you guys must be preparing to put forth some value proposition, mm -hmm. you know, to keep you top of mind and competitive with other military subcontractors and contractors. Mm -hmm. Talk about that. So you're right. Uh, uh, you know, right now the administration is looking at reducing the deficit, and if you look at what they've been mostly focused on, you see a lot of defense spending being reduced. And so um, I mentioned to you uh, a quote by former Secretary Gates where he talked about uh, we need to be focusing on the 80% solution rather than looking at the 100% exquisite uh, products. And, and, and there's a price to pay for for those 100% products, and there is a time, so time is money. Parvis, uh, um, we develop modular-based systems. Um, we help our customers understand how to deploy those systems given their requirements. And so uh, it, it, part of our strategy is based off of uh, newer, uh, later, and greater technologies. But again, if you look back at the uh, uh, company uh, being part of a bigger group, Eurotech, we're doing some pretty interesting things. Uh, for example, the cloud. Uh, you're starting to see micro clouds pop up in the military market. And if you look at Eurotech Group, we, we do have a cloud solution. And when you marry these types of things together, uh, when I say things, I'm talking about the C4 subsystem boxes that Parvis has today you come up with a unique solution that offers a niche to the market and and that's the direction that we're going towards. Oh.